So I just watched the Static Shock short film. While this may not seem like a big thing, if I can see two different posts on Reddit for it, then it's big enough for me to review. So I watched it. It is made by... David Kirkman. And it's basically... It, nothing really happens in it. So what happens in the beginning is that we see, like, one scene where Virgil isn't, doesn't have his electricity powers, then we see a pretty badly animated recap of what should happen, and what we should have saw in live action, but I guess they didn't have the special effects budget to do so, because this, this had a budget of $3,000, which is minuscule for a short film. Just to say, this short, short film is about maybe 44 minutes is the video length, but not even all of it is the film. There's like a teaser for another film at the end. So basically... For maybe about in a TV episode's length, three thousand dollars, which is still pretty low budget for a live action special effects superhero thing. But basically, and what happens in it is so Virgil's dad is running for president, not president, but running for mayor, right? And at the end, he gets killed. But the thing is that they never establish a personality for a lot of these characters. Now, I didn't watch the show. So I'm assuming if you watch the show, maybe they're acting in character. I don't know. But, like, there's no, it should be able to stand on its own, and it doesn't. So what really starts happening throughout it is that we see Virgil. We see his origin. Then we see him beat up some thugs, and I can't give it props. I do like the special effects. But lightning and, like, electricity isn't that hard to make the special effects. So, whatever. But basically, they don't really, like, do anything. It really feels like, from beginning to end, I don't really know who Static is. I don't know who his best friend is. I don't know his dad before he died. There's nothing. Heck, the teaser for the next short film, Icon, showed more of that character's personality in, like, what? Two minutes? More than this 40 or 30 minute short, not short film, but yeah, short film, did. So it's just not really develops anything. Virgil doesn't seem to go through an arc. As far as I could see, he doesn't learn anything. He starts in the beginning, at the end his dad dies. That's all that really happens for him. Another thing is that they never really ever even give a shot at the static costume. So he's just wearing what appears to be a black hoodie, a hat, and goggles. And the goggles is the only remnant of his costume. Now I'm not going to be one of those people that says that you can't redesign him, because obviously you can, but it's not even close to a design. It's not even a design itself, it's not a costume. What he's doing is he's wearing a hoodie, he's wearing a hat, he's wearing goggles, and that's it. It's sometimes, he's not even that, he's pretty hard to even pick out from other characters. And the goggles is the only real way you can tell any difference. And what's weird is, is that in the teaser for the icon thing, they seem to be showing a pretty comic accurate costume with a green cape and a red costume. So if they're showing that, why didn't they show statics? It wouldn't even have been so hard. They had a blue hoodie. They showed it in the film. So I don't know why they didn't just put the blue hoodie and then just put a t-shirt and print it off the design onto it. It really wouldn't have been that hard if they just didn't do it for whatever reason. And, you know, there's a lot of small things, like how Static looks like he's like a 25-year-old man, but I guess I could let that pass because teenage actors are never really that good. So I guess I'd prefer it if we had an older-looking actor that does his job a little better than a younger actor that doesn't do it good at all. But mainly, overall, like, the film wasn't that good. It's not that good. And honestly, I feel like Static as a character... Deserves better. I don't even. I didn't even watch the show, but I've heard that it's good, and I feel like he deserves a little more than that. I feel like that the Codiverse as a whole definitely deserves something more budgeted and all that. It's not really. It doesn't do justice for it. It's not that good. It doesn't develop a lot of the characters, so I don't really get attached to these versions of the characters. So I think for the icon thing, and they seem to be developing the character more, at least just establishing more of a personality. So I want them to, A, get some more budget for the costume and effects, because it really was lacking. And whenever Static did use electricity, he used it very little, which means he's kind of underutilized. Um, they could make the story more interesting. This had a lot of political stuff, and it just wasn't as interesting as I hope it'd be. This is coming from a guy who's really interested in a lot of noir political stuff. So it's not very good. It could be approved, and I really hope it does. But I'll be watching the, the Icon short film when it comes out, maybe in a couple months. I'll review it, and I'll see if it improves. So, um, I hope you enjoyed, and have a good day.